It just scratching and itching. It was, it was horrible. Yeah, it's that time again of the year when mosquitoes are on the rise, becoming a nuisance for everybody. And the recent rains we've had could, of course, cause a boom in the mosquito population over the next few weeks. KXAN reporter Casey James joins us live in Northeast Austin with more. Casey. After last week's storm, standing water everywhere, like this retention pond we're at right now, perfect place for mosquitoes to breed. I discovered uh, five mosquito bites on my leg, and I'm like, oh, summer's coming. With temperatures warming up, the blood sucking fly is hungry and on the hunt. Carla Castellanos knows firsthand. I had the worst time with mosquitoes. Like, I, I must have had like 30 to 40 bites on, on my legs at a time. For most, the bites are itchy and irritating, but for others, it can be downright dangerous. Uh, I'm actually really allergic to mosquitoes, and once they bit me, it starts getting really bad. You see, all of that, that's the mosquitoes. You will see a rise in mosquitoes. Entomologist Walker Hale says the little fly is responsible for 3 million deaths a year, mainly in Africa. Experts also want to remind folks to remember their four-legged friends. Uh, your pet is exposed more often than we are, and heartworm is uh, its a huge issue. Visiting the vet can help prevent the disease, and it's easily treatable if caught. Uh, we try to use, like, natural sprays. Uh, we spray it all over ourselves, uh, make sure the dogs get sprayed, too. So, yeah, everyone's just trying to prepare as best as they can. And take the time to walk around your home and drain any standing water you might see. It'll help lower the numbers. Reporting live in Northeast Austin, Casey James, KXEN News. Casey.